Hi there, students. Gruesome, an adjective. Gruesomely, the adverb, and gruesomeness, the noun of the quality. Okay, if something is gruesome, it's it causes repulsion. Ugh. Yeah, it's horrible. It's grisly. Normally, it's got an idea, um, an idea of uh, blood or murder or extreme pain um, attached to it. Yeah, it's something that's uh, grisly. There were there was a gruesome statue uh, on the table. Yeah, it it makes you feel horror. It makes you f you feel fear. Yeah, it inspires disgust and distaste. Ooh. Yeah, um, there there were a series of gruesome murders uh, over the space of a couple of months. So horrific, shocking, awful, terrible. Yeah. Um, the prisoners were gruesomely tortured, yeah? Um, maybe this is uh, uh, very gruesome, but it, it, it is also very interesting. So, gruesomely interesting. Um, okay, so something gruesome. It's something that's shocking. It normally deals with death or injury or pain with blood, yeah? Um... So something ghastly, something macabre, something grim and horrible. Um, okay, so the gruesome scene of the uh, battlefield after the battle had finished. So it's something horrific, it's something grisly, yeah? Uh, a scene from hell, abominable, spine-chilling, yeah? Um, so, yeah, the... Uh, gr if if you've ever been to a slaughterhouse, a place where they uh, kill animals, this is uh, a pretty gruesome place. Yeah, it's um, shocking. It's unpleasant. Um, it deals with death and uh, blood and destruction. Okay, so gruesome. It's something that's really shocking or horrifying. It's something that's rather ghastly. Um, yeah, he has a very g gruesome imagination. Um, Halloween's coming up and uh, uh, the uh, kids want to dress up as uh, gruesome creatures. The gruesomeness of uh, the scene before me made me want to vomit. It made me feel uh, a bit of na nausea. Okay, so this is, this is the idea of gruesome. It's something that's uh, repugnant, yeah? Blah. Yeah, um, it's grisly, it's bloody, it's it looks painful. It make, makes you think of, uh, of death and destruction. Let's see, you can use this word um, informally to mean uh, really bad. So, the meal that they gave us was gruesome. <laughs> yeah? Blech. Disgusting. Um, the, uh, another gruesome day at the office. Yeah? Okay, so gruesome here i'm using it to say that something is just unpleasant it's just was just really horrible but that's um much more much more informal maybe almost sl slightly humorous um so th the yeah the um the performance of my team in the match was completely gruesome. Notice, gruesome is a, is an extreme, so it's completely was utterly gruesome. Yeah, um, nothing. I I have never seen a more gruesome sight. Yeah, more repellently frightful, shocking, and ghastly. Okay, so formality. Let's see. If you use it to describe something that really is horrible. Uh, then um, I would give it a 6.5 in formality. But if you use it informally, if you use it to say um, as hyperbole, yeah, so, um, yeah, the traffic was gruesome today, yeah, then I would probably give that a 4 in formality. So it, the formality depends on your meaning. As to origin, okay, it comes from uh, grew to grew to shudder. 
yeah, um, which um, comes from something uh, from Scandinavia. We've got a Norwegian word, gruesome, horrible, or Dutch, grausam, cruel or gruesome. So enough. If you enjoyed the video, give it a rating, subscribe to my channel, and I will see you soon. Bye for now. I hope that wasn't a gruesome explanation.